How many days until Christmas? It's one week and one day until then. Oh my god. Siri, why am I crying? An excellent question. All right, well, you're good for emotional support. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 17. Whoa. I'm looking fresh out the shower. Today's my last day. Here, like it's so weird. In case you didn't know, I'm going abroad in the spring on a program called Semester at Sea. So um, I'm not going to be living here in my room in California for school. Um, I need to go to Marshalls or something and find a duffel bag because I need another bag to get all my stuff home. Number three, uh, I need to go get my car washed and I think that's it. And then I have to finish my paper on page six out of 10, but I literally have to today because I'm leaving tomorrow. <laughs> Look who it is. She won't get out of her car. Hello. Am You're alive. alive. You what? Am I alive? Am I'm still I? alive but barely breathing, everyone. That's right. TBH. That's right. That's me. Right. We're going to get breakfast. Oh, what year is it? How are you doing? I'm not camera ready for today. Huh? Um, I, got, I just I had know. a... I got four attachments added to my Invisalign because I'm 12. And I'm oh, racing. wow. Nice. I'm yeah. so excited for brunch. I know, me too. Oh, Yay. my hair. <laughs> Brunch time. Yay. What'd you get? Chocolate chip pancakes. Nice. I got mocha and eggs and bacon. And I'm so excited. This is my favorite breakfast ever. And my and last breakfast. Person? Oh my god. That's not what I was gonna say, but stop putting words in my mouth. I just finished my errand. This is a horrible way to film. Um yeah, so I failed to find a duffel bag at Marshall's. So I need to like actually get something today because I have to take my stuff home. Um, but right now my priority, well then I went and got brunch with Orly and then we went and got my car wash and it's all clean. Finally, it's actually been like five months since I got a car wash. And then uh, I just dropped her off and then dropped off a bunch of stuff I needed to donate to Salvation Army. And now I'm going home so I can start packing up my car and um, work on my essay because I have to write four more pages today. It's only, well, it's already 10, 20 a.m. Um, and I was hoping, I'm whatever, I'll have plenty of time. Sierra's trying to find good music for us to listen to. Don't put me on the thing again. Why? Because the I, thing loves you. I, 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 what is this? Is this classical Christmas? It is. Good. I look like da, 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 da. As do I. Mm, this is nice. This is like ready for us to work. I'm so motivated. Wow, work it out, you ballet goddess. Anyways, here and I are trying to encourage each other to be productive. I have to clean my room. She has to write the County Fiorina paper. The County Fiorina paper. So basically, we set a timer of 20 minutes, um, and Sierra is gonna clean as much as she can in that time, and I'm gonna write as much as I can. And it's probably like halfway done already, and I've written like two sentences. So, and I still need to get a double back. And I should probably stop vlogging because I need to keep writing. Which is motivational music. Ten years later, I finally finished my paper. Bless. Ten pages in. Such accomplishment. So proud. Not sure what's happening here, but I need to get through there to turn in my paper. Which I finished. And I'm so relieved. I need to go to the Department of Political Science. So I have to cut through here. <laughs> this is really awkward and I feel like I shouldn't be here. I'm blind by the sun, but I'm feeling free. Just dropped off my paper in this building, and I'm done with my whole semester. Okay, everyone, guess what? I found the duffel section in Target, and I think this is good for what I'm looking for. It's pretty big, it's got wheels. I think I can fit everything I need to in here. Let's hope, because it's my only option. And it's not like ridiculously expensive. It's like understandably expensive. Let's see, these are also um, the wheels. 30 inch. Hmm. I'll figure it out. I succeeded and got a duffel bag. Look at it, it's ugly kind of and boy-like, but who cares, it's functional. And it was cheaper than I even thought. Um, it's set on sale for like $8 off, but it was literally like, <laughs> like $20 off, so it was great. I'm gonna go home, pack this thing up, put my car in the garage, pack it up, 
Um, it's only 4 p.m. and I feel so accomplished. I thought I was gonna be so stressed like running around all day, but I've actually like done pretty good. Um, turned in my paper, got this, and now I can actually finish packing everything and be ready to go tomorrow. Guys, look, my car is in the garage. Like what? This is so odd. I just packed stuff in the trunk and in here. I'm gonna throw this guy in. Um, yeah, so good old, uh, I don't have a name for my car, but my good old car is staying here for the semester in the garage um, while I'm gone. Our driveway's kind of tricky, so, and we've never parked a car in the garage, so I wanted to do it while it was light out still. It's like almost five. I think that's everything that I'm putting in it. And um, bye car. It's been fun. I mean, I'll see you. See you in five months. I got that, I got my duffel packed. I'm like basically done. Like, I feel so relieved. Come look. It's back to the brim. Like, I honestly was afraid of it bursting. Um, but I got everything in there that I need. I just have a couple last minute things that are probably gonna go in my carry-on. And then I have this bag. So I'm gonna have to check two bags, which is like kind of annoying, but whatever. So yeah, it's uh, pretty odd. It's my carry-on. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna throw all my sheets, comforter in this space bag and put it in the car. And that's like it, so. I feel like so at peace right now, which I didn't think I would. I thought I'd be so stressed. Um, but yeah, like everything's out of the bathroom. I'm leaving these things, like cleaning things. I hope she's okay with that. Yeah, this is like stuff I'm gonna wash my face with tonight though and then put it in my suitcase, so. Yeah. Lauren wanted me to come and hang out with her, but I was like, I can't leave because my car is already in the garage. I don't want to put it back in and stuff. So she's gonna come over and we'll probably cry. Yeah. I'm already like tearing up and I barely even started talking. When I turned on the camera, I plan to apologize for kind of my lack of vlogging today. Honestly, I'm not like sorry because since it's my last day here, I wanted to like, you know, take time for myself and spend time with people here before I have to leave. So I didn't vlog a lot of like me hanging out with people and saying goodbye because like it's so hard. I've like cried more today than I've probably cried in the last year combined to be honest. It's hard because I know I have so much to look forward to and I'm gonna have such a great time when I'm abroad and everything. I also feel like I'm leaving so much behind and like last year when I decided that I wanted to go abroad I was like in a very different place and like so unhappy and like I could have left that instant and like not even looked back but now I feel like it's so different. I'm not an emotional person either. Um, like I'm very much like a rational person, but that doesn't mean that I don't have emotions. It just means that like when I get emotional, I just hate myself for it because I know it's not rational. I'm like, Christy, like you are being stupid. Like obviously you're gonna have such a great time and like you're gonna see these people again. Like this is such a big deal you're making it. Yeah, my room's like all packed up, ready to go. Tomorrow morning, in 12 hours actually, I'll be headed to the airport and um, I won't be back here in Orange for six months. I'll see you guys tomorrow when I go home. I'm going to the airport at 8 a.m. so I'll spend most of the day back in home in, in Oregon with my family um, and there'll be lots of Christmas decorations and like I'll actually be able to get in the Christmas spirit and not worry about school and packing and all this stuff. So. I'm looking forward to that, to relaxing for sure. Um, I love you guys, thanks for watching, thanks for putting up with me, and I'll see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 18. Bye.